and welcome everybody to the bonus episode. Bow, bow, bow. <laughs> All right, this is the first bonus episode of this month, and we were requested to do Behemoth, O Father, O Satan, O Son. Um, I can't recall off the top of my head who commented it, it is on the other Behemoth video we did. Um, I want to throw a huge shout out to everyone who watched that video, commented on that video. It's, it's like my most viewed video. Um, I didn't know a whole lot of Behemoth until my buddy Ty showed me who Behemoth was. And to see the community show up like that, dude, is amazing. Um, sorry, I don't remember your name, commenter. I will definitely post it in the description below. I might throw your name up under the set of four over here because I do feel bad that I didn't get that. But uh, yeah, let's fucking dive into this crazy eight minute saga. Let's do this. You fucking suck. <laughs> so happy
Oh shit, did we lose Tristan? I think he's still here. He just muted himself. Oh, okay. Come. Dude, that shit is fucking well, nuts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I know, like, I, I can't wait to really hear you kind of break it apart and tell, like, the actual story that's going on behind everything. But just visually, yeah. man. Visually, this is, like, fucking dark and metal and fucking just amazing like just all the scenery and the different the slow motion the skulls and the fucking just everything going on is just super intense and i i couldn't imagine what it's like to to know to know the song to know the backstory wow. and watch the video and watch everything pull apart like it's got to be fucking cool yeah. well it's funny because i you know i actually i didn't I didn't uh, watch a lot of the video right that second because, uh, like, this song, like, basically borderline puts me in a trance. Like, <laughs> fucking, um, it, uh, and I think it's, I think a lot of it actually is sort of a, when I hear this, I, I kind of flash back to when we saw Behemoth in Chicago. They, they did this whole album front mm -hmm. to back, and, and I had the only out-of-body experience that, that I've ever had not accompanied by any you know substance um, <laughs> uh, and uh and it was incredible like you know I, I didn't know that was possible like to to have something like that happen and so, until i went to that show and, and had it happen um but anyway um yeah so the i mean the main message behind the song is actually really funny because or really interesting, rather, um, because even though it's called "O Father, O Satan, O Son," um, the chorus, or rather, the the beginning um, and mm -hmm. several times throughout the song, he references Akephalos, and Akephalos is this. Um, it's it, the idea is the headless god, right? So it's like um, it means um, it's another way of pronouncing um, acephalos, which would mean without a head in, in, in uh, Greek, basically. And mm -hmm. um, the idea of Akephalos, the, th the thing about Satanists that most people don't get is that the vast majority of them don't believe, like, in in a Satan, like, as, as a god or, like, yeah. a an entity that exists. It, it's actually more like um, just a symbol. And so what's really interesting is, is that Behemoth in the song, they're identifying Satan um, with this idea of Akephalos, uh, which basically is like, the idea is essentially like, if there is a god, it doesn't have a fucking head. There's no fucking brain okay. controlling any of this shit. The mm -hmm. universe is as it is. And the idea is that we take the universe as it is and mm -hmm. we do our best with what we have and a lot of a lot of what that means is um believing in yourself so like for example some of the things he says in the song um one line that um i particularly like is uh he says uh ignite the seeds uh by not to guilt right and mm -hmm. so what he's trying to say there is that like this whole fucking Puritan ethic of feeling guilty about every time you come, feeling guilty about every time that you that you see a hot woman and you think, oh, wouldn't it be neat if like we got together? Like that that's mm -hmm. bad. It, it, or just even guilt that like you want something. Like that's bullshit. Like as long as you don't hurt anybody else, there is nothing to feel fucking guilty about in this life. There just yeah. isn't. Like if you if you don't hurt anybody else you should do you should follow your own will you know mm -hmm. and uh and that's you know the whole the whole back part of the verse the um the sort of um prayer is actually a, a ritual um which has been well established for a long time called the bornless ritual anyway i don't need to get too deep into it i've already <laughs> rattled on too much i'm very sorry hopefully if hopefully the audience will be interested in this. <laughs>
Um, anyway, I just I appreciate so much whoever uh, commented on this, and and I'm sure that Jesse will fucking put your name down in the thing. Oh yeah. Uh, because I truly love this song. I love this band. I think that the message is important, and also the music just fucking slams. So. Oh yeah. Um. Yeah. That's that's all I have to say. I'm done. You guys. You guys talk. Uh, um. Before <laughs> anyone else goes though. Uh. First off, sorry for the technical difficulties. These things happen. Um, you know, nothing's perfect. So when things fuck up, you know, you can tell us in the comment section, but we already know we're working with what we got. <laughs> um, but I want to show the picture of me and Ty after that yeah, concert. It's, one of my favorite um, it's really hard to see. I wonder if I can get it closer. Yeah, there we go. That oh thing is God. sick. So we you such, can see. We were such little babies. <laughs> But yeah, around my eye is blood. The blood that they fucking, they spit out into the fucking, yeah. into the crowd, dude. And I felt it hit oh. my face and I was like, oh, this is fucking amazing. We got out and took that picture, so dude. Incredible. I was so just, uh, uh, fucking, it was so hype. Um, yeah, I can't explain. Like, it, it it's amazing. Oh. Really, if, if you haven't gone to a concert, go to a fucking concert. Check that shit out 100%. Um, uh, it looks like Tristan can't figure his shit out or he broke it or something. So that's awesome. Caleb, what do you think, man? Uh, yeah, my laptop died right in the middle of that. So that's super cool. Oh, uh, good. My phone as quick, as quick as I could. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I honestly, I'm not a huge fan of like black metal, dark metal or any metal that you can't understand the lyrics of. With that being said, that shit was dope as fuck. And and their message in it is you have to really think about it as you listen mm -hmm. to it and decipher what their message is. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. that part I really appreciate. Like there there's there's too much music out there that is just in fucking layman's term doesn't make you fucking think and, mm. and this shit makes you think and and also I guess it really has an appeal to me uh, from a religious standpoint of you know a non religious standpoint <laughs> if, if you can understand that um mm -hmm. of, yeah of of just uh thinking for yourself fucking be as you will and you know i don't know just uh don't be a cunt <laughs> yes yeah. yeah ironically ironically satans are you satanists are usually like yeah, the least cunty. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're, <laughs> that the, from what I understand from Satanism is that there there's two different two different there is forms or churches. I don't know what they're fuck they're called, but there's not Either much one. to di differentiate from the two. But mm -hmm. both of them are, you know, don't be a fucking cunt be a good fucking person and th yeah. that's kind of the motto that i live by so if yeah. you can do those things then it, even if you even if you can't do those things even if you are a cunt but <laughs> you still you don't want to be a cunt and uh <laughs> you understand that um that other people aren't your enemy because they don't think like you. Yep. That's 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 kind of like the the main belief system that that I want to follow is is mm -hmm. uh even if you're not good, even if you're even if you know you're a bad person but you're trying to be better, mm -hmm. do that. And yeah. If somebody else is a bad person, but trying to do better, don't fucking 
judge them. Like, yep. don't... Don't fuck with them. And too many people fuck with too many other people. Yeah. And Dude. the fucking name of religion that it's fucking... <laughs> but, yeah. The... Yeah. All that aspect aspect of fucking of metal, I can get behind. Um, I just don't know if I'm gonna bump it in my car. That's all right. Pardon me, you don't have but to, I still man. appreciate it. I I appreciate the music, <laughs> their art form. I guarantee I would love the fuck out of their live show, bro. Yeah, oh, and. Yeah. Yeah. If we get a chance, we'll fucking do that because it's wild. <laughs> I'm sure. It's the best. It's the best thing in the world. All right. But, Again, uh, looks like uh, Forceful yeah. Glizzy is uh, dealing with his phone overheating and something else. I don't have any clue. But sorry for the technical difficulties. Sorry you don't get his side of things. But yeah, amazing episode. Thank you so much. I did have time to look up who sent that, and it is I'm going yes. to butcher this, and I apologize. Uh, Powell uh, Kazim- Kazimierz. I'm gonna I'm gonna Powell? show you. On, is, oh, can I can I show this on is screen? It is it gonna be too bright? A-V? I can't see it. But wait, wait, Pavel. I bet he's dude. I bet that's a Polish guy. Pavel, yeah. I think is a Polish name. Yeah, and again, yeah. I apologize. Oh, I shit. I butcher names all the time. Oh, man. That is awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for so much for commenting. Thank you, Pablo. Please like, comment, subscribe for more videos like this. Um, you know, seeing what videos that you guys like to see is what is going to kind of influence what we pick for the bonus episodes. You know, if so, yeah, like, like the comments below, fuck it, you know, start conversations up. We're always here. I'm always trying to like, and, start conversation with with everybody um again check out sauceserve.com he's the man he's a small business owner he does everything on his own he does all the drawings that you see down below check out his website check out all that stuff we'll see you next week peace out